This is the balancing chemical equation, video number 10. I have completed the first three steps in pen. I have written the word equation, the chemical equation, and written out the chemical symbols for the atoms that react in the reaction on the reactant and the product side of the equation. Now I need to count the number of atoms of each element that reacts on the reactant and product side in pen by tallying. So there are three carbon atoms, one, two, three, eight hydrogen atoms, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and two oxygen atoms, one, two. On the product side, there are one, just one carbon atom, one, two, three oxygen atoms, one, two, three, and one, two hydrogen atoms. So I need to put my black pen down and ask, is it balanced? The answer is no, because I have an odd number of carbon atoms on the reactant side, three, and an odd number on the product side, but only one. Now I can increase that by putting a three in front of this carbon dioxide molecule. I need to retally one, two, three, three times two, six, seven. I have eight hydrogen atoms on the reactant side, only two on the product side. To get it up to eight, I put four in front of the water vapor molecule and retally. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's also retally the number of oxygen atoms because there's oxygen in the water vapor molecule. So three times two, six, plus four, ten. As you can remember, even numbers are much easier to deal with. Now, to get the number of oxygen atoms up to 10 on the reactant side, I need to put 5 in front of the oxygen molecule and retally. 5 times 2 is 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Ask, is it bad?